Hi guys, so I was just getting ready. I already did my makeup and I still need to apply my lipstick. But uh, that's something that I do at the very last minute, like before leaving the house. Uh, so for now I am applying this chapstick. All right, so I already did my makeup. Now I need to do my hair because I am getting ready to go out to celebrate my birthday because today it's my birthday. Uh, I am the cumpleañera, I am a year older now and um, while I chat with you, I want to start getting ready. So, I need this curling iron that I recently got um, from Hot Tools. I can't remember how thick it is, I will leave it somewhere in the screen and in the description box of this video as well. But um, I ended up getting this one because this is the same uh, thickness, the same tool that my hairstylist, my hairdresser uh, uses on me every time I go to see her. So uh, last time she did these curls on me and I really liked them because they were defined but not too... Uh, not too tight. So I wanted something like this and she recommended this brand and I have been using this brand for years and I love it so much that I actually have more of these. So I have the one that I just showed you and then I have this one in the middle. I have had this one for what five years now and uh, these ones are the longer version like the X extra large I would say for longer hair uh, so I have been using this one for five years now and it's good as new I mean it looks a little bit dirty here because it has a little bit of product but it is really good I just wanted something a little bit thicker because I noticed that the curls that this one was giving me were a little bit too tight so I just wanted something a little bit loose and then I have this baby one which is the one that I use for touching up the pieces of curly hair when I wear it like my natural curls just to touch up those pieces that are, are a little bit straight so yeah I have been the biggest fan of this brand I think that uh, they're, they're hot tools well the name is hot tools but uh, their curling irons are so good and they're really affordable so I really like them that's done and now let's start doing this hair because I am in a rush. I am running a little bit late. I still have to do many other things. And uh, we have a reservation in this restaurant. Uh, I think it's Spanish cuisine. Um, yeah, so I saw it as a recommendation uh, from someone I follow that lives in the city and I just wanted to give it a try and that's exactly what we're doing today to celebrate so i am going to be applying these um protective heat protectant this one is from bumble and bumble i have been using this for years now and i really like it because it feels like like a serum it says it's, it says it is an oil but it doesn't feel like that it's more like a liquidy uh serum and i really really like it uh it's not heavy at all and yeah really nice and it smells amazing I love it so and this lasts forever like this bottle I can't remember when I bought it but it is really good so last night I washed my hair I uh, used a flat iron just to smooth everything out so now I just want to start doing my curls so I want to divide the hair here I am going to keep doing my hair as I said I am in a rush and then I'll see you later because this is going to take a while put on my shoes and grab my bag to leave the house because I am actually running late and I found this little surprise I wasn't expecting this this beautiful red velvet cake and it's just so nice I wasn't expecting this it says happy birthday Mariana and it's really funny this is just pure coincidence because the flowers actually match the flowers that uh, you can see in my in my dress so it's just really funny and yeah this is so nice
morning everyone so i feel like i owe you an apology because it's been a couple of weeks since the last time you saw me in this vlog um and i have been a little bit absent here on youtube and on instagram as well because i haven't been feeling well like i have been having this awful pain in my belly on the right side and it's more like it feels like a sharp pain uh and it's a pain that lasts for four or five days all day with no break in between and it's just so painful i cannot get up i cannot sit down i cannot lay down it's so annoying and of course i, I am feeling like super bloated like i am three or four months pregnant uh it is very concerning i already um I've gotten that pain before and I always ignored it. I initially thought that I was just like having issues with my digestion and everything, but now I am really concerned because this is like the fourth or time number five, I think, that I get this. And uh, I already called the doctor, made an appointment with a specialist and yeah, so we will see, we will have to solve that. So anyway, um, so I am go I'm about to open my uh, birthday present from Sephora. So, yeah, because like maybe two vlogs ago, I made a video about uh, a beautiful, not two vlogs ago, like a video ago. I made a video about Sephora, um, but it was just like a really small order. Um, this one uh, is a Valentino um, perfume uh, born in Roma. I will give this a try later because I don't want to make this too long. And I think I chose a Tom Ford um, um fragrance as well uh but they didn't send that yeah they didn't send that so instead they they sent this uh ysl black opium um this is a green one yeah elucid illicit green yeah that's the name of it so anyway and here what is this no. Here is the birthday present uh, that you always get and I didn't know this and it is the fact that when you want to get your birthday present uh, you can only get it two weeks before or two weeks after your birthday because I tried to uh, get my birthday present uh, before those two weeks and uh, it wasn't able I wasn't able to uh, add it to my card so yeah so this is it I got the translucent powder from Laura Mercier. This is the powder that I use every single day. It's just so nice. And then on the side, how can I get this out? Maybe from the bottom. Okay. And here you get, what is this? Like a little crayon. Caviar stick eye color crayon. So, oh, that's so pretty. Okay, so here you have it as you can see it looks like like a champagne like an ochre color it's just so pretty like a bronze color that's the 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 name i was looking for so it's just so pretty i think that you can use this as an eyeshadow so maybe i will wear this tonight all right so that's that um i got from Sephora this scalp massager this is something that you use uh, for when you're washing your hair and everything and this was only like 10 or 12 dollars and this is really important to you know, to have a little bit of uh, circulation and I love the ordinary when it comes to skincare it is uh, really affordable and um, you just need the active ingredients like you don't need to spend a lot of money on this so i got the chemical peeling like the chemical uh, exfoliator uh the one that looks like uh, blood i got that one i love it and then i got the salicylic acid it's really really good i just wanted to get this because uh, i have been getting um, some little spots of acne and i just want to get rid of that and then I got uh, this little sample of the Super Goop Glow Screen Body. This is uh, SPF. Uh, and this was a sample that I chose with, um, I think it was with a promo code, I think. Yeah, so I will give this a try. I have tried the, uh, it's the clear one, the invisible one. Really, really good. Like I am using uh, one from Banana Boat, one from uh, La Roche Posay. Those are my favorite sunscreens, but uh, this one, super good, is really good as well. While I am opening this, I just have to say, guys, that I don't know, like, I just turned a year older, and I don't know, it's like my health has been declining. It's so weird. And on top of that, when I had that um, that pain for 
so long after that right after i got a little bit better i got my period and i get super painful periods uh, with headaches with super strong migraines and it was like uh, come on give me a break and then okay so this is an amazon order but wasn't an amazon order like if you know what i mean so the the brand for nail polish that i use is opi or op uh, so that is my favorite brand uh, I always go for nudes for the basic colors and I just wanted to replace all of the, the colors that I always use so I went directly on their website and I ordered from there because when I go uh, let's say at uh, the grocery store or the, the drugstore as well sometimes the colors that I always go for are always sold out so I just decided to go on their website and I ordered them and then the page sent me to Amazon so I had to check out there so I got um, let me buy you let me buy you buy you a drink I will leave the name somewhere in the screen or in the description box of this video but the 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 funny thing with this brand is that they change the names with food with places uh, so this is someplace somewhere and I really like this one because it is a white color more like a pearl color it has a little bit of a sheen to it uh, but it's it's not too much it's not that opaque that bright of a white because i don't really like that uh, so i really like this one because it is really natural and speaking of white i have this one funny bunny this is a color that, that got really popular on tiktok and i saw a girl using this one with um the chrome effects is like a powder so this got really popular on tiktok because Hailey bieber uh justin bieber um wife um gets her nails done with funny bunny and with the chrome effects powder that i'm talking about and it looks so nice i haven't been able to get my hands on the powder because it is completely sold out you can actually get it on at walmart online uh, but it's completely sold out so I have to keep an eye on that and then for a really beautiful nude I have this one that is called Samoan sand, you know, like Samoa like the place uh, And I really like this one because it matches my skin tone so good. It's just so nice and uh, One of you actually asked me in one of my blogs. I think it was a beauty video something like that what nail polish i had on me and it was this one so if you have a skin tone like me with you know if you're a little bit tan or something i am looking really pale right now uh, this one is really good but if you're more if you have a pale skin tone more like a pink skin tone i will say uh, that you go with tiramisu like the dessert tiramisu for two that one is really good uh, but i stopped using it as just because it was a little bit too pink on me but yeah, really nice. And then I went for uh, Bubble Bath, which is the color that I have on my nails right now. I do my nails at home. I do uh, the French tips, tips, yeah, like the French thing. Um, and it's just so nice. Last but not least, I want to open, uh, this is a package for Haney, my dog. Uh, this is something that I get um, quite often. And I am talking about treats for dogs. So I initially discovered this brand um, at Whole Foods. And uh, I have to mention that my dog, Haney, is a 12-year-old. He has a very sensitive stomach. So it is hard for me to find like good treats for him that uh, don't have artificial ingredients and uh, things that are not going to harm him. So as I said, I found this brand. Um, it's called Happy and Healthy uh, at Whole Foods. I kept buying it for a while and then I was like, you know what, let's buy directly from the, the, the seller, like the company. So I did that, I went on their website and I have been buying this brand for over a year now um, and it's really nice. And the funny thing is that apparently the owner uh, of the company uh, recognized my name and how often I buy and uh, I think it was in the last order. He sent me with my receipt a letter I mean, it wasn't nothing like weird or romantic, no. It was like a, a note, a little note uh, with his handwriting, really, really nice, thanking me for always buying, for being so loyal with my purchases. And that was just really nice. And he included a free bag for me in the last order. So yeah, I will keep buying from 
this company it's something really natural you don't have uh, bad ingredients or anything like that for your dogs so um i want to show you this one that i have here is beef liver this is just liver and it is dried then i am um, here we have pork lung okay, there too. Kenny loves them this one is chicken and i got turkey as well so this was let this will last me for I don't know, I'll say a month, a month and a half. Uh, but now it's going to be a little bit less because I have been sharing these treats with the dog, my neighbor. Uh, she's a little puppy. Uh, she's around like six months old and I have been sharing these treats with her because sadly, she's always left outside. Like most of the dogs here in New Mexico are left outside or at least in my neighborhood. And I don't understand why. Like in my opinion, that is just cruelty because it is really hot outside uh, sometimes you just want to get in I sometimes they are left outside even in the winter 24 7 and I just feel so bad for them um, so yeah not my business but I just feel bad for them and if I can uh, give that little puppy uh, a little something of happiness with a treat I am more than happy to do it all right guys so i just want to sit down here and i want to start talking about uh some exciting things and if you if it is too bright on my face you will have to excuse the fact that i'm actually using my ring light it is so dark so cloudy outside so hopefully it can get a little bit better because i'm actually going out tonight all right so if you follow me on instagram or if you follow me on tiktok you may have seen what i got for my birthday already so this year i wanted to treat myself to something nice something very nice i would say so i don't have a physical store nearby so i had to order online and this year i had um a trip planned for las vegas to celebrate my birthday but it didn't happen because we didn't we couldn't find a person to take care of my dog he's a dog with special needs so yeah it is hard to find someone that's going to take care of him all right so this is what i got this is the box that it came in and i'm talking about a beautiful handbag from dior dior is one of my favorite designer houses when it comes to many things one of my favorite brands and i just want to go ahead and show you what i got Ta-da! So this is what I got. This is a beautiful Lady Dior bag in the small size, ABC Lady Dior bag. You can tell the difference between uh, the bags because of the strap. So this one has the white strap, the charms as well. And I just have to say that I am so happy with this. Um, I actually thought that it was going to be a little bit heavier, but it's not, so I'm okay with that. I really like the classic style, how structured the, the bag is. I love the top handle because it looks really dressy. You have the option of the crossbody strap if you want something a little bit more casual. It is so nice. I just love the pattern, the cushion that it has because it actually brings me a lot of memories uh, from my childhood. This is something really silly, but growing up, uh, we had the same chairs that Christian Dior had uh, in his runway when, you know, like he got inspired by that, by those chairs, the wicker chairs uh, for this. So he printed that in here. So uh, growing up, I had the same type of chairs and I remember putting pressure on the chairs to be able to get the same pattern printed on my skin. It was it's something really silly, but uh, it brings a lot of memories from childhood. All right, so I just wanted to go for a classic style, classic color. That's why I went for black. I was a little bit tempted to go for uh, the blush color or white. I even love the red one. I want a red bag so bad. But I just wanted to go for the classic color, classic bag. And I have been loving this bag for a really long time, for years, I will say. This has been my dream bag for a while. So it is actually really funny because uh, one of my aunts is like my second mom. We both share the same style, similar style. We have the same love for the same uh, designer houses and brands and stuff like that. So uh, this was a big purchase. So I actually called her, hey, let me know uh, what do you think about this? I am about to buy this for my birthday. It is a big purchase, but I am not sure. And she was like, go ahead and buy it because it is my dream purse as well. It is so beautiful, so timeless, so classic and so elegant. So don't think twice about it so i did <laughs> and i am really happy all right so um guys i want to mention something and i don't want this to come across like i am showing off uh i am not i'm just sharing my happiness with this bag but i don't want to i, I don't want this to sound like i am explaining my finances because that's not the case i just want to be real with you guys and let you know that i actually saved a lot of money 
for years uh, to be able to get this. Uh, this is uh, not an impulse purchase. I wanted it for a really long time. I knew that I wanted to get this one. Um, but I mean, my point is that I was once in your position. I was once a viewer uh, and I have been following many YouTubers throughout the years and I always wonder how can they afford that? How can they get that and everything? Uh, but that's not the reality, you know? There is a lot of things behind many of those things. At least that's my case. So in my case, I had to save a lot of money to be able to get this for years, four years, uh, money uh, that I got from working and stuff like that. So don't, please don't get the impression that I am here showing off, that uh, it is easy to get uh, this type of things. Uh, if you know what I mean, I just want to be real with you. Uh, hopefully it doesn't come across like I am explaining myself. I just wanted, back then, I just wanted someone to be as honest as I am being right now, if you know what I mean. All right, so I just don't want to make this video way too long. My battery is dying right now and I have to uh, do some things before I leave the house. So yeah, this is my new beauty, my new baby. All right guys, so as you can see, the weather didn't get any better. It is still cloudy, dark. Uh, I was just uh, filming the rest of my TikTok, my reel, uh, you will see it on my Instagram, um, uh, for this look, for this dress. All right, so uh, we are going to this restaurant that is supposed to be uh, 10 feet, over 10,000 feet above the ground. It is on top of a mountain. We actually have to take a tramway, a tram or a tramway in Spanish is Televerico. But it is very exciting because it's been a while since I've been in one of those. So uh, this tramway is supposed to be one of the, 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 the tallest, like the highest uh, in North America. That includes Canada, the United States and Mexico. So hmm, that's very interesting. So as I said, we're going to this restaurant. It is very nice. Uh, maybe this time I can give uh, the paella a try. Maybe they have it because last time when I went uh, out for my birthday, I regretted it. That steak that I got wasn't that good. So, all right. So I'm talking too much. This dress is from H&M, a linen blend dress that I got a while back. It's not available anymore, unfortunately. And I am wearing my saddle belt from Christian Dior. It's It's been a while since I wore this, this belt, so I just wanted to give it a chance. And of course, I have my Lady Dior bag. It's just so nice. And uh, they go together really, really well. So I have the crossbody strap on just because I am afraid that I am going to need my... I don't know, my hands free uh, because I'm wearing heels and I, don't, I just don't want to fall. And here I have this blazer because as I said, this is up um, in the mountain, so I don't want to get cold. So here is the outfit with the blazer over my shoulders. I think it looks really good. I love this color combination. Let's go together.